Hey you guys and welcome back to my channel. Um, I have not done this in a while. First, <laughs> be sure if you are already subscribed to my channel, you go ahead and hit that red button and uh, subscribe, hit that bell, get some notifications so that when I post content, you can see it. And uh, yeah. So, I have not done an Ipsy unbagging in a while, but I went ahead and got the December bag because I got my feelings hurt last month because I skipped November. I haven't canceled, but I skipped. And I got my feelings hurt because they gave out the Lisa Frank bronzer. And it's the only thing I want. It's like, like when I get that, like, I'll be so happy. I just want that Lisa Frank bronzer so bad I can't stand it. So I signed back up for December, and I still didn't get it. Ipsy, if you watch me, like I need that Lisa Frank bronzer. That's why I keep skipping, because I get mad, because I haven't gotten anything Lisa Frank. And like, Lisa Frank is everything. I want it. Anyways, on to this unbagging. This is the bag this month. It is super cute, silver. Got a little blue up here and on the little zipper. Got some glitter. Absolutely adorable, perfect for the holidays. So, the first thing I've got actually would not fit in the bag. I got these Phil Brilliant Bamboo Charcoal Facial Sheet Masks. Uh, they're supposed to be detoxifying and pore minimizing. And they sent me two, which is always good, so I can give it more than one try. And I'm gonna try this very soon. I have not tried it yet though. I'm gonna have a me night soon and try these masks and watch some Glee, probably. Because <laughs> that is my favorite show right now. Okay, so the next thing we got, y'all wanna be excited about this bag. I can't. I got a, a dirty little secret <clears throat> eyeshadow stick crayon thing. And like, I just, I don't like these. I got one in a boxy charm a while back. I'm like, I was mad that I got one of these in boxy because boxy usually makes me so happy. And then I got another one. And I'm, I kind of think it might be almost exactly the same color. Like, I don't even know how to use these. And I think I might give this to my niece. It's in the color Fetch. Kind of like a gold color. By the way, check this out. Is this not like the cutest little bracelet ever? I got it from this little shop on Amazon. And uh, I don't know, what's the shop name? Kinsey? Kinsey. I don't know. But I think it's adorable and it's a wonderful present. And uh, actually, I think this might be one of my sister's Christmas presents, but I opened it and I'm tempted. But, uh, yeah, it's gorgeous. I'm going to leave a link to it in the description, but I had to wear it because it's so pretty. Anyway, so this eyeshadow stick, I just don't even know how you use these. Like, I got no clue. I just don't like them. Don't. I have no logical reason. I've never really tried to use them. I just feel like they would mess up all my makeup. So I just don't like them. I love everything else about Dirty Little Secrets, though. Don't think I hate them. Their regular eyeshadow and like their lip stuff is so gorgeous. Just not that. <clears throat> okay, then I have a product by Shella, Chella, Shella. Eyebrow Defining Gel. And I think, uh, yeah, this is like translucent, clear, whatever, I'm being confusing. And you just do this little number and lock your brows in place and I'm using it right now I've actually never used brow gel but I've been told it would help me a lot and that is just a sample size but I guess I'm trying it I'm trying it okay so then I have two more things this I'm very happy with I got a Lexi brush who doesn't love Alexi? This is a precision shader brush. And it looks like this. It is a 239. 
Usually the brushes I get from them are like pretty colors, which makes me happier, and this one isn't, but that's okay. Um, I think it'll be really good like in this outer corner, trying to, you know, deepen up that outer V. Should be very cute for that. They're not cute. It's, it's not cute. It's effective. It should work well. And the last thing I got, this I was excited about. I got an Ofra, a long lasting liquid lip, an Ipsy unzipped. You can only get it in an Ipsy bag. It's like a limited edition shade. But something I found a little weird and almost like, almost kind of tacky. They, they put their coupon code on the packaging. I don't know if y'all can even see that, but literally on the packaging, it says use code Ipsy30 for 30% off at OfraCosmetics.com. Who does that? That's weird. But it is a pretty color, so you know, I'm not gonna be too mad. Let me give you all a little swatch of this color. And Ofra does have a really good formula. Um, I've gotten some of their lipsticks before, like I know I got one in Boxy. They're very pretty, pretty long wear. Gorgeous colors. Dry down matte. I think this should be a matte one. At least I hope it is because I don't really like shiny lippies because I feel like they don't ever stay. I don't know why they just don't. <clears throat> but yes, that is, that's it. I don't know y'all. I don't like hate Ipsy. I just wish that there was a way that there could be like full size things in it. Like even if it was 20 and I got a cute bag with full size things. That'd be nice. I don't know. I, just, I don't find much use in the samples. So like the little stuff, I just don't like it. And I've done that stinking quiz like 20 times and I still get stuff I don't like. I feel like the quiz is a lie. This, this is what I think about Ipsy. But I'm going to tough it out a couple more months. And and see if I get some of the stuff I really wanted. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I mean, this is not a bad box. I got a good brush, I got some face mask, got a decent lippy. It'd be all right, that's worth $10, but I don't know. Boxy Charm has spoiled me, I just want more. But yeah, so that is my Ipsy. I'll let y'all know next month if I decide to cancel. I really don't know, I can't decide. What do y'all think? Like. I feel like I should, but I feel like maybe like as soon as I cancel, it's going to get amazing and then I'll be sad that I canceled. I don't know. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments, but that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed and uh, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.